Hi, I just wanted to give you a quick update. I just returned back from Kenya. I was able to split my time between Naomi's Village and Haven of Hope. Naomi's Village is a children's home that was born out of Grace Community Church about 10 years ago. And Haven of Hope is a community-based organization founded by me and my wife and our Kenyan partner, Grace. For the Naomi's Village part of the trip, I was able to do multiple trainings with Naomi's Village staff, as well as staff from Leap Preschool. I did a lot of prayer sessions with staff and kids at Naomi's Village and saw God move many times while I was there. For the Haven of Hope part of the trip, uh, we were able to do home visits. Uh, we were able to visit 10 households, uh, families that we know in the area that are sick or elderly or just can't provide for themselves. And we actually had one family say that they had prayed the night before for God to provide them with food. And then we showed up the next day. So praise God, we were able to be uh, the answer to somebody's prayer. Also, we have two big Bible studies uh, that we host for Haven of Hope. They're in two separate locations, one in Maimahu, which is the city that Naomi's village is in, as well as Rari, which is a city that's uh, just outside of that, about 10 kilometers in the Rift Valley. We have about 300 people that attend our Bible studies, and so uh, we bring the word to the people, and we also do Bible distribution for them and try to hand out as many Bibles as we can. And we also pray for the sick or whoever wants prayer. So we're able to pray for hundreds of people and through the power of God, we saw many people healed and set free. And some of the testimonies that we saw come out of that were just absolutely wild. Uh, we had people testify that their sight had been restored and that tumors had disappeared and that open wounds that they had had for a long time had closed up. So praise God. Through several generous donations, we were able to buy about 15 new soccer balls for Naomi's Village and two guitars. Uh, there are multiple kids trying to learn guitar right now, and they were super happy to get two awesome guitars that they could actually play on. I just want to thank God for everything that he did while I was in Kenya and in Swahili, that's Sifa Kwamungu.